Hello everybody, my name is Zoe Rebecca. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And today is going to be a vlog. And today is Monday, February 5th. It is currently 8.11 in the morning. And I just wanted to film a vlog for you guys, just kind of showing you guys what I do throughout a normal day as a college student. I am in a specialized program, so I am in an accelerated program as I've talked about. But like my class schedules are really weird and I like, I basically have one or two classes. I have different classes every month, so each class is four four weeks long each course length is four weeks long so there's just a lot that I have to do for each class in a very finite short period of time so I just kind of wanted to just show you guys what I do like on a normal day and not explain everything necessarily but just kind of show you guys what I'm doing but yeah so I've been up since about six Theo just went to work about an hour after that I just changed my clothes I'm wearing these cute jeans and this cute shirt with this really nice comfy hoodie and I was just about to go log on to my school portal thing and show you guys some of the content that I have open for the class. This stuff opened at like midnight this morning. Okay, this is editing Zoe here and I just realized that I don't think I made it very clear that the class that I'm going to today is the class I'm starting today. I haven't been there yet and I think I kind of like alluded to that but I don't think I made it very clear that the class I'm going to today is the first class of this course that I have. I haven't been to this class yet so I don't know what to expect and that's why it might seem a little confusing why I can't really start anything in advance because this is the first class I don't know anything about it and I would like to find out some more information in person in class before I try to do anything or submit anything <laughs> So this is a multimedia storytelling class. So that sounds like it should be interesting and fun. So there's all of these assignments that I'm just gonna like look through. I don't know how much I'm gonna submit. I mean, I can submit some things, but I just wanna like kind of look through everything. And well, this, I guess some of this stuff isn't open, but whatever is open, I'm gonna look through and maybe just get started on it. Cause it's really annoying. This class, this particular course, I don't have class until 7 p.m. today and Wednesday. And and next week, Monday and Wednesday, and the week after that, just Monday, and the week after that, just Monday. So I literally have this class six times, and then I'm done. So that's literally how a lot of my classes work. I just have it like six to eight times in four weeks, and then I'm done. And so yeah, I usually, up until this point, I've had two classes per month. This month is one class, so I'm probably gonna have a little more free time than usual. So I will have more time to make YouTube videos, YouTube videos about school and about other things, but I know that a lot of my demographic is in college, college students, maybe not necessarily in college, but college student age range. And I know that when I wasn't in college, I would always find it fascinating to just watch videos of people in college just vlogging typical college day for them just because I wasn't getting that experience. So I was getting it through them. I was just living kind of vicariously through these vloggers. So I kind of want to serve as that for some of you guys. If you don't go to college, but you're around that age and you're just curious about my experience and also people who are also in college and can relate to this and people who have passed college and remember what it was like to be in college or whatever or people who haven't gone into college yet and want to know what the experience is like whatever age range or part of your life you're in or whether you care about college or not I feel like this video will give you some insight as to what my experience is like right now and as you guys know I'm gonna keep freaking bragging about this because I deserve to I have the highest grade in my class right now I've been told that I have the most consistently high grade in my graduating class right now so I am super proud of myself for that as I should be you should all be proud of your accomplishments and not feel like it's cocky or narcissistic or selfish to be proud of yourself about your achievements because you're allowed to that's healthy you're allowed to feel confident you're supposed to feel confident so yeah I just wanted to start today's vlog off with this little spiel for you guys and yeah so I have another video my Taylor Swift song ranking video that I've been discussing it's finally going up tomorrow it was so much footage that it has taken me forever to edit it but it is going to be worth it and you guys better watch that shit because I'm working so fucking hard on it right now and I said that in my Sunday reset video, but I'm emphasizing it again that I'm working very hard on this video. Please watch it. Thank you. <laughs>
everybody update time it is now 1207 and i just like i showed you i looked through some of my assignments i watched a couple of the videos that he wanted us to watch before class and i just looked over a lot of the assignments but a lot of them he wants us to do in class so i didn't start any of the assignments yet but i did look over them so that i have some sort of idea of what they would be and i smoked with my dad earlier what else did i do i watched some youtube i edited some more of my taylor swift video and now i'm probably going to make myself some lunch i figured i would give you guys an update as i'm making my lunch there we go on top of the iced coffee maker but i just wanted to update you guys with what is going on i actually need to do some dishes as well because yeah i need to, I need to do the dishes so i'm probably gonna do some dishes and then i'm gonna make myself some lunch i haven't decided what i'm going to make yet but i'm probably just gonna i don't know listen to music or watch youtube or watch tv or something while i'm doing the dishes i'm making myself some lunch so i will cue the time lapse and yeah Hair is down. Time to make some lunch. I still gotta wash the wok and like two of those like pan lids. Not pan lids. Pot lids. Oh my god. These. I still gotta wash two of those in the wok. But everything else is done. Everything that's like, you know, really needed to get done is done. So now I'm going to make some pasta off the pouch that I could just heat up in the microwave real quick. I'm gonna throw some sauce on it. I need to charge my camera battery. It's flashing at me and yelling at me. So I need to charge that. And I will make myself some lunch and talk to you guys in a little bit. guys it is currently 2 25 p.m and honestly i've just been i ate some lunch i had some pasta with some sauce like i showed you guys and i had some lemonade to drink i was watching the bear for a while i'm on season two episode seven so i got seven eight nine ten left four episodes left oh i also smoked a bowl while my camera battery was charging and that's pretty much all i've been doing like i told you guys i overviewed some of the classwork i have to do and i got a head start on one of the assignments that we're going to be working on today in class just so i had some sort of idea of what i'd be doing in class because i don't like to procrastinate and i like to get a head start on things and i also don't really have much else going on so i might as well use this time to get a head start on my school work because that's what is my priority right now when i'm living here for school yeah so i just wanted to fill you guys in give you guys an update my battery is fully charged now so that's good and yeah so like i said i don't have class till 7 fucking p.m which is so annoying and it's scheduled till 11 p.m i kind of hope that they don't keep us there till 11 p.m i like to get my money's worth and get my class time in but I honestly don't want to be there till 11 p.m. I really don't. The earliest I'm gonna get out is probably like 9 so that's not fun for me but at least it looks like an interesting class so like I told you guys it's called multimedia storytelling so based on this description in the about section of the course it's basically visual storytelling and communicating moods, emotions, ideas, sounds, scenery through props. Students will learn how to represent the four-dimensional world through clear and evocative writing so I'm looking forward to that that sounds right up my alley and I don't know I've just really been enjoying my coursework and that's why I'm doing well because I enjoy it and I'm interested in it and I'm passionate about learning about it and I'm looking forward to establishing myself as a professional creative content writer screenwriter whatever kind of writer just overall creative writer just really establish myself and the way that I establish myself is by getting an education through school and really learning more about it in a professional kind of context rather than just creatively what I want to do what I'm used to doing and what I'm used to writing about and how I'm used to writing it. It's really good to have a well-rounded, multifaceted perspective about the professional world of creative writing and I've learned so much about it through school already and I have so much more to go. And at the same time, by the end of this calendar year, I'll be almost done with school pretty much because I graduate in July of 2025. So like it's gonna go really fast but I'm also like super excited for it to like be that fast paced because I just enjoy what the content is so much and I enjoy learning it so much and you guys know I'm an impatient person so I'm glad that this is accelerated and I can just get it done but also really learn at the same time and my classes are still spread out so I'm still having time to process the information and do well I don't know I just really like the format of the whole program and I can't stress that enough so if you're a creative individual Full Sail might be for you too they're not sponsoring me this is not an ad but Full Sail is a really good school based on my personal opinion but yeah anyway ultimately I just wanted to fill you guys in and give you guys a little
little update as to what I've been doing and I might watch another episode of The Bear. I might smoke another bowl. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do yet. I don't know when Theo's gonna get home today. We'll see. I'll let you guys know when I find out. So I just ran out of storage on my SD card and had to delete some videos to get some space. So I'm gonna have to delete some more. But yeah, I'm gonna go through that now. And yeah, I just ultimately wanted to give you guys an update and I'm just rambling now like I do. And I'm probably gonna wanna get out of the apartment before I go to class just to get out because I'm feeling a little stir crazy and cooped up here. So when I go out, if I go out before class, I'll let you guys know and I'll show you guys what I'm doing. Okay guys, it is now 3.16 p.m. and I just watched a little bit more of The Bear. I just watched another episode and now I'm gonna do some laundry because this needs to be dealt with. <laughs> and I'm finally going on my first outing of the day. Theo just got home not too long ago and we are going to get some Zaxby's for dinner. So we just ordered it. He is going in the shower now because he's got to do his, you know, blue collar post-work shower. And while he's doing that, I'm going to get the food from Zaxby's. So I just wanted to fill you guys in that I'm finally going on my first outing for the day and going to pick up some dinner for us. Tasteful, Theo. Thank you. Such a boy. Anyway, hi guys. I'm back now. Just wanted to fill you guys in and say I was back from Zaxby's now. And we're gonna smoke Theo's after work bowl Ew. and then eat some dinner and watch some This Is Us. And then I gotta go to class at 7. So fun, Ooh. fun stuff. Exciting times. Hi guys, update time. He just looks so cute and funny just eating <laughs> the Texas toast. Like, why are you eating it like that? Oh, with, the, <laughs> with the middle. <laughs> okay, whatever. Okay, it's just an odd way to eat toast. But anyway, it is 6.15 now and I just wanted to give you guys an update. We were just, you know, eating our Zaxby's for dinner and watching some TV. And now we're just chilling until I have to go. Okay, that just like stopped recording. I don't know what the fuck just happened. But anyway, so I have to probably leave for class around 6.40. So I'm just gonna chill until then and I'm kind of tired already. So that's nice. I hate having class this late I don't know why it was scheduled so late. I don't know why they're doing this to us There's literally like five other people in my class too. Just torturing six people for no reason. Love it But anyway, just want to give you guys an update and uh, yeah, that's about it. Nothing really fun or fancy going on right now no. 
Hello guys, it is currently 9.38 now and it is time for an update. And I got back from class a little bit ago, a little less than an hour ago, and I took my pill, smoked a bowl, FaceTimed my dad for a little bit. Since I got back, class was good. There was like literally like five other people in my class, like I said. It was a very small, intimate setting. It was nice. My teacher was cool. He was, you know, chill dude, gave some good criticism. He said that he was gonna be like an asshole throughout the class and like give criticism a lot. And I appreciate that. We all need that to learn and grow and I'm glad that he warned us I guess but yeah so I've just been chilling since then for a little less than an hour since I got back but I wanted to give you guys an update and yeah so I'm gonna go to bed soon so I wanted to end this video here I hope you guys enjoyed my just day in the life vlog as a college student with a really weirdly late class so yeah I'm gonna end this video here if you guys like to give it a big thumbs up make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell share this video and my channel to those you think might be interested and leave me comments comments down below and make sure you guys check out my memoir battles on the borderline and my poetry book and erotic anthology and my psychology make sure you guys stream all my music out and my spoken word album out make sure you guys listen to my podcast as in flows with zoe frenchman make sure you guys follow me on all my other social medias my snapchat is zoe frenchman my instagram is zoe r frenchman my twitter is zoe rebecca f and my tiktok is zoe rf420 so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video and i'll talk to you guys in my next one bye